Good morning out there to everyone who's watching this video today. I hope that you're having a great day and I hope that it stays great for you. Thank you for joining me here on Retro Geek Gaming where we like to talk about retro geek and gaming related stuff as it says in the title of course. Um, but, and so before we get into the formalities, let me just go ahead and just throw it out there. You know, that I appreciate all the views that I can get. Uh, so just to show support for the channel, feel free to drop a like if you want. That way I know that you've seen the content, you like it, and I can sort of use, use that to sort of gauge where the channel is going, the way I need to change things. Feel free to subscribe if you want. No pressure from me, of course. And of course, you always can feel free to leave a comment about any of the stuff that we talk about in this video, future videos, or past videos. Love to have you guys around. Hopefully you'll stick around, and thank you for joining me. So we just have a couple of... Uh, real quick news articles to sort of talk about and bring up here. Um, the first one is not really that big of a surprise since it has been on all the previous consoles before with the last one. But we did get confirmation uh, a few days ago that Hollow Knight Silk Song has been confirmed for PS4 and PS5. Which is cool. Like I said, Hollow Knight was on Switch, it was on the Xbox consoles, it was on PC, it was on both the Playstations. And now we have the sequel um, that's coming out for Switch both the Xbox consoles, PC, PlayStation 4, PlayStation 5. Which is fine. I would much rather prefer a release date. Maybe that's coming soon. At least that's what I would like. I would like for it to come soon to give us an announced date to know when we can expect the Dawn thing because it was announced initially in 2019 and we haven't really seen or heard much from it since. Um, Outside of some gameplay and stuff like that, which is fine. Show me gameplay, but I want to know when we're going to expect it. Because I love Metroidvanias and I'm looking forward to playing this. And also, the next bit of news is also no surprise. Also, um, basically, it is that Sega has confirmed that Yakuza is apparently no more. They're going to continue the series with the name Like a Dragon. After all, the um, it's only known as Yakuza over here, apparently, outside of Japan. Um, and maybe it's just because, again, you know, Yakuza is kind of the thing that they call gang, so... Um, but the last one was called Yakuza Like a Dragon, so as long as they go forward with, like, Like a Dragon and then some kind of a, of a subtitle, it probably won't be that big of a deal. But also, as you can see from this article, it's known as Ryu Ga Go... Ko Dang it, I just butchered that and I do apologize. Ryu Ga Go... Tuku, which I don't understand why I have trouble saying that. Maybe it's because of the God Go back to back. But I'm having trouble saying that in one go, and I do apologize. Uh, but that's the name of the series in Japan, which basically translates to like a dragon. So for, J for Japanese people, the name doesn't really change. It's just going to be called like a dragon in Japan, and now like a dragon outside of Japan. So it's really not, big, not, not that big of a deal. Um, but what do you guys think about that? Do you think that that's kind of a weird change, maybe for people in the States or outside of Japan where it's known as Yakuza. Who knows? Um, I don't think it's really that big of a deal because it's like when they call Resident Evil 7 Biohazard and it's known as Biohazard in Japan. So it's just like you just called it, you just called the game Biohazard. Like you basically were rebooting the series, which they kind of did. They kind of did reboot it with the first person view. But. That's neither here nor there. What do you guys think about that? And I did see here that this actually sort of linked off into the fact that they are making a live action adaptation. Uh, that is an older article from 2020, so I don't know how, uh, yeah, from 2020. So I don't know how much of that is going to actually uh, come to fruition, but I think that'd be nice. I think Sega does need to do more, um, more movie stuff, you know what I mean? The Sonic movie seems to be going well for them. So maybe Yakuza uh, or Like a Dragon, the movie, it might work. Uh, and we also did talk before about how they're apparently doing Space Channel 5 and a Comic Zone movie. Um, we'll see how those turn out. But that's going to be it for the news, guys. Um, not a very long video, I understand that. It's just a couple of real quick news articles to talk about. But what do you guys think about them? Do you like the idea of, you know, Yakuza being changed over to like a dragon? Are you indifferent about it? Are you anything like me and you want the Silk Song release date to be announced? Um, that's going to be all that I got. And uh, if you want to, make sure you join us because I think it's going to be either Thursday or Friday. We plan to do the Retro Rewind as I talked about earlier. We're just going to sort of just 
shoot the breeze about whatever comes to our mind as far as topics go uh, for the Retro Rewind. And we got some great ideas planned for that as well as for this channel. We might get an intro soon, uh, might get a lot of stuff worked out. Um, and hopefully we'll start doing specific Retro Rewinds where we talk about games that we're both playing at the same time and talk about them. And um, like I said, you just feel free to go ahead and leave comments if you want about anything you want us to talk about. Go back and put them on older Retro Rewind videos and I'll see them be like, hey, this person brought up this, you know, this particular topic uh, and we'll, we'll talk about it. Okay, uh, that's going to be it for me. Uh, I have babbled on long enough, so I appreciate you guys if you did watch this far. I do apologize. I'm working on not talking as much, not babbling as much, and going around in a circle. It's kind of hard with my ADHD brain. Uh, but have a good one, guys. I'll see you next time in the next video.